uh, you have given the signal that you've arrived at a verdict. And if that is the situation, I would like uh, the bailiff to step forward and uh, take the written verdict form from the four person. Okay, the bailiff can publish the verdict. Please rise. People versus Jeffrey Thomas Willis, case number 166040FC. Count one, open murder. Guilty of first degree murder. Guilty of first degree premeditated and first degree felony murder. Count two, kidnapping, guilty. Okay, thank you. You may be seated. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, you've heard the uh, verdict announced by the bailiff that you find the defendant guilty of first-degree murder based on both first-degree premeditated and first-degree felony murder. Uh, is there anyone who disagrees with that verdict? Please raise your hand. All right, you've heard the verdict announced that you find the defendant guilty of kidnapping. Is there anybody who disagrees with that verdict? Please raise your hand. All right, let the record reflect that no one indicated disagreement. Do you care to have the jury polled, Mr. Uh, Hilson? No, sir. Mr. Johnson? No, sir. All right, thank you. Then this will stand as the verdict of the jury. The uh, judgment of conviction will be entered. The defendant is remanded to the custody of the Department of Corrections. Sentencing will be on, do we have a date? Uh, we don't, Judge. I believe right. it's uh, July, June. Uh, June 12th. June 12th? June 12th? Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm thinking of please. Right, June 12th. Okay. Sentencing will be scheduled then for June 12th at 9.15. Um, and the defendants remain in the custody department of corrections. We may take the defendant. Um, and we are concluded. Um, yes. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, go ahead. Go ahead and take them out. Uh, I want to express uh, the appreciation of the community to you for your extraordinary commitment to um, providing your services to uh, seek justice in this case. This has been a, a very long and imposing um, imposition on your lives, and I truly understand that. Your community understands that, but your community is grateful for your being willing to participate in this. Um, and when I say your community, it's not me. You're here for your community. That's what our system of justice is about, is to have 12 people selected from the local community to make these decisions. And I know it's difficult. Um, I have to do this every day. And uh, you're not accustomed to it. So um, I, I know it's difficult. It's burdensome. It's hard on your family. It's hard on your friends. It's hard on your employers. It's hard on you. Uh, but as long as we have this system of justice in America, this is the way it's going to be. And we're going to call on jurors. We'll start another trial next week. And we'll call another set of folks who will come in and give their time and their effort. And when you think about it, a lot of people fought and died for this opportunity that you had. So uh, when you think about it in those terms, it becomes a little bit more palatable for you, at least. Um, but you are, at this time, discharged from further service. Um, you can go about your business. You can talk to anyone you wish to about the case. You do not have to, and the bailiff advised me that you've all unanimously agreed on something else that you don't want to talk to anyone about the case when you leave here. So the bailiff will be escorting you out, and I'm going to let the audience know here that the jurors do not want to talk to anybody. And I hope you respect their privacy. They've given a lot of time here, and they're asking to be left alone. So we're asking you to cooperate in that regard, and the bailiff will see, see to it that they're escorted from the building without their privacy being invaded. Did any of you have any questions you wanted to ask before you left about the procedure or anything? Just one thing. Yes, sir. Uh, 
Okay, well, thank you very much for your participation. You are discharged. Make sure you take your things out of the uh, jury room, and uh, the court will stand in recess. <clears throat>